Hey there, my name is John Siskovich and right behind me is the brewery that I'm part owner of. Now right next to the brewery is our tasting room and I wanted to take you guys on YouTube for a quick tour of that. Now, uh, if the, the brewery is a new building, the tasting room is an original dairy barn that was here when we got the property and we have fixed it up, renovated it to make it a uh, enjoyable customer experience for everybody who's visiting. Now our little uh, entryway here is the old milking room. The milk chiller used to be right here where they would chill the milk down before they pumped it out into the milk truck. Um, it is now has uh, taken shape of our farm store. We have gotten rid of a lot of stuff this winter to kind of minimize it and we're redesigning how the interior is going to look this spring uh, so that is a great kind of informational entryway for our customers going forward and I'll, I'll share that progress as I go through the year and implement a lot of it. And my freezer with my chicken and my pork. And it needs some restocking after the weekend, but that's great because that means sales are good. And then here, we'll see how the GoPro camera does with the low light. But uh, starting from left to right, we have our bar. I built this chandelier out of a, a log from the original, it was one of the original wood beams that was in the barn before we renovated uh, and just punched lights down through it. There's six beers on tap. This bar, uh, the top of the bar, I made out of the siding that used to be on the outside of the barn before we renovated and uh, poured epoxy over the top of it, custom welded a frame around the top. Uh, the tin on the bottom is from an old mill in upstate New York. Honestly, we just found a guy at Craigslist with some cool looking tin. Um, six beers on tap, bottles and cans to go. Uh, moving around the room, I have these fun pieces of tin in the ceiling just to kind of break it up visually and uh, create an, an, a dynamic audio environment. And uh, yeah, I hope it looks cool in here with low light. It is a fun and relaxed place to come and hang out. Uh, we have our barrels stacked along this wall. Now a lot of those barrels say cool milk on them. And uh, with the cool milk barrels, what that is, it's a cool ship beer in the milk chiller. And cool ship beer is before they had um, really, uh, the, before they had uh, heat exchangers where you would send cold water one way and the hot young beer the other way. Uh, you would leave it outside in a tub and then the cold air in the winter months would cool the beer down and it would inoculate it with wild yeast and then you would store it in a barrel so that that yeast could churn through that young uh, sugar water, the wort, the young beer that we talked about in yesterday's video. And uh, it would age over time. Uh, you would get different flavors out of different barrels and different batches of beer. You would blend them together to get something you would like. And that was the foundation in a nutshell of farmhouse brewing and beer brewing, uh, which is kind of amazing. Now turning around, we have our uh, big fun mural the so last thing to show you, Kate and my good friend Dan Hamilton, who does all our label art for our bottles, painted the mural when we were first opening to the public. And now uh, it is just one of those things that I enjoy looking at every time I come in here because it is visually very pleasant. Our open hours are Thursday, Friday, 2 to 7, Saturday, 12 to 5. And uh, happy to answer anything in the comments for this video, or if you wanna know more details about all the little details in here, I can create videos in the future. But as, I just wanna kinda of get started and show you guys around, um, that was the point of today's video. Hope you enjoy the rest of your day. I hope you enjoy your week. Tomorrow we'll be going on to a different part of the farm. And until next time, I will see you out in the field. Mm -hmm.